Science News Special, Duada of the Earth, Lone Star Geyser, Explodes, Iceland Roars, Etna Rumbles, and Kalawia Burns, Bright. Duada, the deep, thunderous heartbeat of the Earth, is echoing around the globe once more. In an extraordinary alignment of natural fury, four of the world's most volatile geothermal giants have awakened almost in unison, shaking the planet with their power and catching both scientists and the public off guard. From Yellowstone's ancient geysers to Iceland's cracking crust, from Italy's fiery Etna to Hawaii's seething Klauea, the Earth is roaring. Yellowstone, the Lone Star. Geyser eruption that made the forest tremble. Deep within the backcountry, trails of Yellowstone National Park, a dramatic and unexpected eruption of the Lone Star Geyser brought sheer panic to hikers and geotourists. The event began with a low rumble, almost like a growl beneath the feet, before erupting in a violent upward blast of boiling water, reaching nearly 45 feet high. The geyser, which typically erupts with moderate predictability every three hours, exploded nearly an hour ahead of schedule with far greater force than usual. Visitors screamed and ran for cover as the forest around the geyser echoed with sharp hisses of steam and the thunderous splash of falling water. Park rangers quickly moved in to secure the area while seismic sensors in the upper geyser basin registered ground tremors linked to subsurface hydrothermal pressures. While experts insist this does not indicate an imminent eruption of the Yellowstone supervolcano, the abnormal energy release from Lone Star has elevated the geothermal alert level and triggered an urgent round of subsurface analysis. Iceland. The roar returns to the land of fire and ice as. Yellowstone trembled. Iceland's volcanic soul cracked wide open again. After months of restless quakes and ground deformation, a fissure tore across the Reykjanes Peninsula, birthing yet another eruption from the Fagradalsfjall volcanic system. In a deafening burst of molten rage, Glowing lava burst forth from the crust, lighting up the night sky and racing toward vulnerable areas. Civil defense sirens wailed across Grindavik as emergency responders evacuated homes and cordoned off highways. Eyewitnesses described rivers of fire cutting through the darkness. The Icelandic Meteorological Office warned of increased magma pressure and the risk of further fissures opening in the region. Though this is the 11th eruption in just three years, scientists believe we are witnessing the birth of a long-term volcanic cycle, one that could transform the region for decades to come. Etna, the Sicilian giant, wakes again. Farther south, the Mediterranean trembled as Mount Etna rumbled back to life. The ever-restless volcano, a towering symbol of Sicily's raw nature, began belching ash, gas, and glowing lava from multiple summit craters. Locals in Catania looked skyward as clouds of black ash drifted across the sun. Ground tremors shook. Villages nestled along the slopes. For now, Etna is smoldering, but not silent. Italy's volcanologists have raised the alert level to orange, noting strong harmonic tremors and satellite thermal anomalies. They warned that a more powerful paroxysmal eruption could follow. The people of Sicily are no strangers to Etna's voice, but this latest chorus of rumblings is louder and deeper than before. Hawaii's Ke Lauea, a new crater, burns in the night. And in the Pacific, Ke Lauea is once again ablaze. A newly opened 
Vent inside Halemaumau Crater has erupted with violent intensity, spewing glowing lava high into the air. A fiery lake has formed in the crater's center, boiling and bubbling with fresh magma. Scientists from the Hawaiian Volcano Observatory are monitoring the rapid inflation of the summit, signaling an active and pressurized magma chamber. This latest eruption follows weeks of ground uplift and seismic swarms. Residents living near the volcano are being warned of toxic sulfur dioxide emissions, lava hazards, and potential fissures. Drones and satellites are now being used to monitor the rapidly growing lava lake as Kaod Lawia shows signs of entering. Another volatile phase, one that could rival the 2018 eruption that destroyed entire communities. The Earth is speaking, and it's speaking in fire four regions. Four simultaneous acts of geological defiance. The question on many minds, is this a coincidence or are we seeing a broader planetary pattern of unrest? While geoscientists confirm these events are not directly connected, the clustering of such, dramatic volcanic and hydrothermal activity is statistically rare. It speaks to the immense and unpredictable energy stored beneath the Earth's crust. A reminder that we live on a dynamic planet, one still forming, one still breathing fire. The word duada echoes through the scientific community this week. A sound, a beat, a signal that the ancient forces of Earth, the ones beneath our feet, are shifting once again. And though modern science can track and measure these forces with greater accuracy than ever before, it cannot silence them. The B, Earth is alive, and this week it reminded us with steam, with ash, with lava, and with a deafening, undeniable roar.